So we just put these new brake line fittings and these new brake lines and we want to preserve this and make it last a little bit longer. We don't want it just to rust through and start leaking again. So we have this extend rust neutralizer. So it neutralizes the rust, it chemically changes it so it won't continue rusting. Now what this is really good for is like light surface rust and this will just take that away. If something is really rusted, like we had some brake lines that were just about rusted through, this one wouldn't quite work. It did coat it, but we don't really trust it basically as a rust fixer. So we just put new brake lines and new fittings on and we wanna make sure that these fittings stay nice and clean, they won't rust through. So what we did was we took some Extend, it's, um, it's a rust neutralizer. It's made by Loctite. And what this does is it chemically neutralizes the rust so it won't continue rusting through. So this is great for like light surface rust. So if we, we we'll also use it to just keep the rust and do some preventative maintenance and keep it from just starting to rust. Once this stuff dries on here, then we'll even take some spray paint and go over it with that and this will really keep it and make it last long. So we're gonna apply some of this to the back of the brake line, but we don't have a brush right now that will work for this. We'll, a rag will work fine, just a little scrap of one. So we'll get some on the rag, and then we can dab it around here. And then once that's on there, we'll just wait for it to dry. It kind of almost turns blue whenever it dries. And then we'll let that sit on there for, I don't know, half an hour, an hour. So here's a steel brake line that was on the other side of the car that just rusted. It actually rusted through and sprung a leak. So all the brake line that we put in is some new nickel copper stuff. I would highly recommend putting this on your car. It is basically impossible for this to corrode and it'll last a really long time. So on these brake lines, what they do is they coat the entire brake line in plastic. I had to use a heat gun to be able to get this off and just get it where it's melting. And you can see that's in really good shape. It's not even rusted at all. But probably about on the last two inches, they didn't coat it in plastic because you still have to be able to fit the fitting on and the flare tool, and then you can bend it around. So they weren't able to coat the little, the, just the very last bit of it. So this would be a good spot before it gets too bad. Just put some extend on there and that'll keep it from getting really bad. So once this dries on there, we're going to go ahead and spray just a coat of black spray paint and this will really add another layer of protection. And this sure is easy to break through when you're working on it. It's easier to break through than rust. So I put all the extend on the joints that we worked on and some on the old brake line. And we're just trying to prevent this rust from getting worse over time. So the extend is dried. It almost kind of looks clear. If on the other side here, it <clears throat> has a little bit of a purple cast, but it probably would be a good idea to put more and more coats, like six coats. But since we're spraying with the spray paint, we don't really need that. So we're just gonna take the spray paint, shake it up, and it doesn't really matter if it gets on the suspension pieces and stuff. So you don't have to be super precise with this. And just clean that up and do that to all the fittings and pieces. So there's a few techniques on really just how to preserve your brakes and brake lines and just make sure they won't rust through and they'll last longer. So I hope you guys found this video useful. If you did, don't forget to like and subscribe and we'll see you next time.